What's up, everybody? Logan here, Stock Investor, aka Crypto Investor, back with another video. Today, we're going over the Toby token. Now, the Toby token is a very popular token on the uh, base chain. This is a base meme coin. Uh, it's been trending basically almost every time I check in the last uh, few days here, maybe the last week. Uh, token actually came out 16 days ago, so it's probably been trending almost uh, for 16 days on um, on Deck Screener. Right now, it's trending number three on Deck Screener. It is up 128% in the past 24 hours. They have a really big market cap. Uh, we're going to go over the information on Toby the Frog of Base in just one second. But before we do that, just quickly, I am not. A financial advisor. This is not financial advice. I'm not telling you to buy this token or anything like that. This is strictly just information. Take it with a grain of salt. Always do your own research first before investing in anything, especially crypto, because crypto can be very volatile. Also, there is a ton of referral codes down there in the description box. Have a look at those. Best referral codes for the best crypto apps. You can get yourself free money, free rewards, free crypto, things like that. Just by using those referral codes down there and funding your account. It's real simple. Referral codes benefit both of us. So check them out in the description box. And let's get into this token here. So... If you did uh, want to get this token, uh, you could get it by uh, funding your trust wallet or your MetaMask wallet uh, with ETH or your Coinbase wallet with ETH going into the dApps and uh, finding SushiSwap. It's available on SushiSwap. So first you would bridge your ETH to the base chain. Uh, they'll most likely tell you how to do that exactly step by step on Toby's webpage which is toadgod.xyz. So you bridge your ETH to base and then use your base and the contract address that you can find on their webpage to trade your base for the Toby token. Now, again, they most likely will tell you step-by-step step how to do that on their webpage. Now, they have a telegram you can follow at toadgang, uh, and they have 2,721 members. 395 of them are online. Um, and they have their webpage, toadgod.xyz. And it says here, uh, Toby, the frog of base, preserving a based culture with the most elite toad god. A total of 420 trillion tokens. 70% of the tokens go to airdrop. 30% go to the liquidity pool, and it says they have been burned, and you can verify that on a base scan. And then it says 10% reserve, and then there's token details for that. It says there is no dev allocation or compensation, no funny business, check it all online, burning LP keys, renouncing all, get Chad devs to check, simple breakdown, 70% community airdrop, 30% LP reserve. Uh, Toby's core focus is on giving back to all the underdogs and, of course, to base. Uh, then it has a link to Warpcast, their Twitter, their Telegram, Dex Tools chart. It also says they are listed on CoinGecko. It says all toads can be frogs, but all frogs can be toads. It's a one-way destina destination. Toads win the war every time, especially a based one. So they don't really have an audit or anything like that on their webpage. They don't have a team docs. They don't have that, but they just uh, they do say that liquidity pool is burnt, and you can verify that on their page. I don't see a lock and burn uh, uh, button on uh, deck screener though, so just be aware of that. I don't see it on there, uh, but it is on their base scan there. And it says their market cap and FDB is $24 million right now. So a very well-established project. Like I said, trending number three on uh, Deck Screener still. You can find their webpage, Twitter, Telegram, all on Deck Screener. 
It says price of the token is 7.5 cents per token. And yeah, pool was created uh, 16 days ago. So there's two audits, two quick audits on Deck Screener, one by Go Plus Security and one by Quick Intel. And there's no warnings on either one of them. So that's great to see. It says tax is not modifiable, ownership renounced, no hidden owner. Uh, it says open source, no honeypot, no proxy contract, no mintable tokens, can't pause transfers, no trading cooldown, can't sell all, owner can't change balance, uh, no blacklist, no whitelist. And yeah, so all sorts of... Uh, all sorts of good stuff there on their quick audits. So there's nothing, there's no like red flags that stick out. Now they don't have like a full extensive like CERTIC audit or anything like that. But from what I can see, there's no warnings. That doesn't mean it's 100% safe and it's not financial advice. I'm just saying that I don't see any red flags. Still could be risks though. Now, uh, if you go over to CoinGecko, it says, according to GoPlus, the contract creator can make changes to the token, such as disabling cells, uh, changing fees, minting, transferring tokens, etc. Exercise caution, which is very strange because it says the opposite on Deck Screener. So that's weird that they have that warning on CoinGecko, but then they actually don't have the warning on Deck Screener. So I don't know why. It, yeah, confusing how CoinGecko has warnings sometimes that don't pop up anywhere else. <sighs> yes, annoying. I don't know why. Um, now, their base scan says they have 756,259 holders. Now, they do have a lot of holders, obviously, because they've airdropped, right? All those holders not, do not come from people buying the token. So just be aware, it said 70% of the tokens go to airdrops. So a lot have been airdrops, so just be aware of that. And um, they have 61.45 uh, pooled ETH in SushiSwap, which is equivalent to 3.57 trillion TOBI tokens. And that is basically all the information. They have a DEX score of 92 out of 99 and a community trust score of 100% out of 15 votes. And besides that, you can check out their Twitter if you want to. I'm going to put that in the corner of the screen. Blue verified check mark, 63 tweets, just joined in March, 6,322 followers. At ToadGod1017 uh, has a link to their webpage on there. And they have their contract address in the pinned tweet, so you can check that out as well. Now, I am not a financial advisor, so one of you guys let me know in the comment section down there. What do you guys think about this token? Do you think this is a good investment or not? Make sure you guys like this video. Subscribe for daily crypto videos where I go over the newest coins and tokens and what their info and utility is. And uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Y'all have a great day out there. Peace out.